Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. If you always watch our channel, you may know that the news about ASML and China chip. Expansion of chip production capacity is not uncommon in the semiconductor industry. TSMC has built factories in the United States and Japan, and SMIC has also formulated mature chip production expansion plans in four domestic cities. And this time H. Grace Semiconductor also officially announced that it plans to invest 45 billion yuan in China to expand the production of 12-inch wafers. What's going on? What does it mean for major manufacturers to expand their production capacity? Chinese enterprises expand production of 12-inch wafers. The market's demand for chips is changing all the time, and it takes only a few months for the demand for chips to go from skyrocketing to plummeting, and the industry can show another state of affairs. During 2021, Hundreds of industries around the world will be immersed in the atmosphere of lack of cause. To what extent is the lack of cause? TSMC announced that it will spend 100 billion US dollars to expand production of chips, and ASML revealed that a company obtained chips by dismantling washing machines. Coupled with the rising prices of wafers, materials, equipment, etc., the atmosphere of core shortage has swept the world. However, in the second half of 2022, the shortage of cores began to improve. Consumers no longer have much desire to purchase electronic equipment, smartphones cannot be sold, and computers have no strong purchase demand, resulting in excess chip production capacity. From January to November last year, China reduced the import of 84 billion chips. With the reduction of chip orders from U.S. companies, TSMC's chip capacity utilization rate also decreased. As a result, giants such as TSMC have announced plans to reduce capital expenditures, intending to live on a diet. However, SMIC has presented a different situation and has not changed the chip factory project. Its 12-inch wafer production line projects in Shenzhen, Beijing, Tianjin, and Shanghai have not changed. Moreover, the production line in Shanghai was capped at the end of last year, with a planned monthly production capacity of 100,000 wafers. On the one hand, there is a decline in demand for chips, and on the other hand, the continuous promotion of factory projects does not seem to meet the changes in market demand. H. Grace Semiconductor is also expanding production of 12-inch wafers. On January 18, H. Grace Semiconductor issued an announcement announcing its production expansion plan. The announcement showed that it had signed a joint venture agreement with multiple parties to inject $4.02 billion, approximately $2.72 billion, into H. Grace Semiconductor Manufacturing, Wuxi, Company, Limited, hereinafter referred to as the joint venture company. Billion Yuan. In addition, the joint venture will also raise 2.68 billion US dollars, approximately 18.1 billion renminbi, in debt financing. With the support of nearly 45 billion renminbi in funds, the joint venture will expand the 12-inch wafer production line for the production of chips in the 65 55 nanometer to 40 nanometers process. You may know something about SMIC. After all, it is the largest and most technologically advanced chip manufacturer in mainland China. An H. Grace semiconductor is relatively unknown, but in fact, 
The route taken by H. Gray Semiconductor is different from the mainstream. SMIC has mastered the mass production technology of 14 nanometers process chips, while H. Gray Semiconductor mainly focuses on mature and characteristic process fields. Based on the 0.35 M55 NM process, it has certain advantages in semiconductor power devices and characteristic integrated circuits. H. Gray Semiconductor knows where its advantages lie. In the past few years, the capacity utilization rate has been at a relatively high level. Even if it takes a special process route, it can still get the support of customers in the market. Therefore, in order to further expand production capacity and meet more customer needs, it decided to cooperate with multiple parties to jointly invest 45 billion yuan to expand the production of 12-inch wafers. Compared with 8-inch wafers, the scale of chips produced by such wafers will be larger, which is also the main direction for the majority of chip manufacturers to expand production. What does it mean for manufacturers to expand capacity? Manufacturers will not expand production for no reason, it is related to tens of billions of investment projects, and it is impossible to make a decision lightly. So the expansion project must be deliberate. H. Gray Semiconductor currently has one 12-inch fab and three 8-inch fabs in China. Once the expansion plan is completed, it will hold another 12-inch fab, which will significantly help expand production capacity. According to H. Gray Semiconductor, Hua Hong Wux's wafer fab capacity maintains a very high capacity utilization rate, so it will continue to expand production line capacity in 2023. So what does it mean for manufacturers to expand production capacity? It may mean that the chip market demand is not saturated, especially in the field of mature chips. Although TSMC has encountered customers cutting orders, the capacity utilization rate of many chip nodes has been reduced, but these are mainly concentrated in high-end process areas such as 7 nanometers and 5 nanometers. Consumers no longer purchase smartphones, computers and other consumer electronic devices in large quantities, resulting in the chips equipped with them being unable to sell. However, the production capacity of mature chips is still strong. Even TSMC is expanding its 28 nanometers chip production line at its Nanjing factory, investing 2.8 billion US dollars. In addition, SMIC has four chip production lines on hand, which will be used for the production of 28 nanometers to 180 nanometers process chips. The demand for high-end chips has declined, but mature chips still have great application value in the Internet of Things, smart cars, edge computing and other fields. Now that H. Gray Semiconductor has joined the production expansion team, it also shows the fact that mature chips are not saturated. As for what kind of market share can be obtained, the key lies in production capacity. Today, chip manufacturers such as TSMC, SMIC, and H. Gray Semiconductor have announced their own chip expansion plans, and all of them involve mature chips. It's a huge market, with even greater demand than high-end chips. It is expected that sufficient orders will be released in the market to lay the foundation for the development of the industry. What do you think about this? Welcome to leave a message below to share.